Hi buddy, Dawn here. I know I've not been keeping up on videos at all. Last time you guys saw me, I <laughs> announced that I was pregnant. Well, here I am two months, a little more than two months later, and I have a baby. She is 10 weeks old. See her car seat over there. And she's probably going to start crying, so we'll see what happens. She does not like sitting in the car unless we are moving. And right now we are waiting for Connor to get out of school. And I tried not to come too early, but we still have... Right now we have seven minutes to wait until he is actually out. So I'm hoping that she does okay. Otherwise I'm going to have to pull into the parking lot and get out of the pickup line. Because she may need a bottle. Um... She is nursing and formula feeding, so she nursed, like, right before we left. But usually she also gets three ounces, you know, within the following hour, so I may have to pull over and feed her if she gets too fussy. Um, gosh, what can I say? There's so much I could say. Um, <laughs> childbirth was nothing like I thought it would be. If anybody wants me to talk more about that, that um, just leave me a comment or something below, and I'll be happy to, you know, maybe do a video on that. Um, I'm going to work really hard on getting videos up at least once a week. Um, I've been working on some scrapbooks, and um, if I can, I'm going to hopefully get a share video in later, even today. Um, I did a Halloween envelope album that I want to share. Um, but parenthood is not what I thought it would be. It's awesome, don't get me wrong. I love being a mom. I've always wanted to be a mom. But I thought I had all this experience, you know, taking care of kids. It was going to be a breeze. It's not. When you bring your own child home, it's different. Um everything affects you on a deeper level, even than when you're taking care of somebody else's child. Um, and that doesn't mean that, you know, I gave less care or affection or whatever to other people's children. It's just when it's your own, it's, it's just, I think it just happens. Um, her name is Glory, Glory Melissa. And, um, tomorrow she'll be 10 weeks old. Um, as of last Thursday, she weighs 11 pounds and, um, she was born at eight pounds, 20 inches. And, um, yeah, as of Thursday, she weighs 11 pounds. Last time she was measured for her length, she was at 22 and a half inches. So she's growing like a weed. I already want her to be as little as she was when she was born, but you know, they grow. Um, it's been a challenge. But I'm embracing it. It's definitely making me better just overall as a person. And, I mean, it's even helped with my health. Um, my mental health. <laughs> um, don't get me wrong. I'm exhausted. And some days I just sit and cry. Um, but I'm working on it. And, you know, of course there's times when she's crying and I just cry with her. And, you know, when your baby cries and you can't figure out why they're crying, it's so hard. But, um, I'll probably, I'm sure I will talk more in future videos. I just kind of wanted to chime in and say, hey, since I had a minute sitting here waiting for Connor, um, usually I don't come pick him up, but I think if I can manage it with, you know, the baby, I will probably be doing it, um, every other Tuesday. And possibly Wednesday every other so we'll see what happens um, Ed Connor's daddy's at work so we will see how that goes um, but yeah I'm a mom um, if you want to see pictures of glory um, I have pictures on my Facebook page um, and I can link that below for you if you like, I can also share pictures at some point. I may even share her on a video. Um, just depends. I think the best time for me to record will be when she's napping or just, you know, 
hanging out quietly. So, you know, it just depends on how, how much is going on. But I do want to get back into making videos. I am really working hard on squeezing time in to do scrapbooking. Um, I've gotten into making hair bows. Of course, you know, she's a little girl. She's going to have bows for everything. So I'm learning how to do actual bows. I mean, I'm just doing flowers and stuff like that. Now I'm learning how to make, you know, pinwheel bows. And I'm going to try to learn how to do a boutique bow. And um, at the same time, I am trying to work on um, my Lily Bell Inc., my Facebook business page. Um, and all it is is just bits and pieces. I just squeeze in what I can do. You know, and sometimes it's only five minutes at a time. Um, but I tell you what, this mama can get a lot done in five minutes. So, you know, it's eventually she's going to nap better and she won't have to be held so much. At least that's what they tell me. So, you know, and you know, when Edward gets home from work, he holds her and that gives me an opportunity to work on, you know, crafting things and on my business because I miss crafting. I think that's really the only thing I miss so much is I just want to craft. Um, and I think it's because of her, I'm inspired more to do and make things because I want to make them for her for the future. Scrapbooks, you know, like a Halloween scrapbook for, you know, her first Halloween, you know, Christmas scrapbook for her first Christmas, um, family scrapbooks, um, just a lot of stuff. So, you know, I'm definitely busier than, you know, I'm, I'm making myself busier than I probably have to be. But so far, that's not what's exhausting me. I think I'm just exhausted from, you know, the late nights and, you know, not sleeping normal. But it's a good kind of exhaustion. I am probably the happiest I've ever been in my life. And she, I mean, she's my reason. So... Um, uh, it's about time for Connor to be getting out of school, so I'm going to end the, the video here, but I will be back, um, hopefully soon, and if I still have viewers out there, you know, leave me a comment below and say hey. Um, so I hope you guys are all having a great day and a great week, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.